warmer temperatures, sea level rise, more severe storms, all signs of our climate in crisis. Now, searching for solutions. Our mission is to decarbonize the planet. From the classroom. It was kind of like climate change, learning about it in disguise. To clean energy. Three million households worth of clean power. To the fight and fills. <laughs> like you've never seen them before. A look at ways our area is combating climate change. Welcome to NBC10's Climate in Crisis. In this episode, we're focusing on solutions and preparation. Our mission is to decarbonize the planet. Rework. Chuck Russell is the president of Inductive. It's a startup company in King of Prussia that sells wireless charging technology to companies with buses and commercial fleets. When you think about putting a smartphone on a pad to charge it, this is effectively a smaller version of what we do when we have a pad on the ground pad underneath the vehicle and we charge a vehicle. Basically, a vehicle is equipped with a battery. A charging station is put on or in the ground. When the vehicle is stopped over the ground station, the battery is charging. When bus comes over uh, one of our ground, ground stations, what it does is it picks up a significant charge. So it's constantly, every time it comes over that, over that pad, it gets more charge. And so the, the idea is it never really runs down. Russell says right now Inductive has 100 buses in the U.S. and Europe. Here's what the charging pads look like at the Kansas City International Airport. The buses still need to be retrofitted with batteries, but you get the idea of how it will work. The company plans on having more than 500 vehicles in service by the end of 2024. It's also looking to expand its workforce. We're going to be bringing on a, a significant number of software engineers. We're going to be bringing on people to, to do AI for us. We're going to be bringing, bringing people in to handle analytics for us. Because our view of what we can do is actually go beyond just providing parts and pieces to enable charging. And Russell believes it's important to hire local talent. You're providing back to your community. People feel like they're attached to you. They feel like they're growing as you grow. Brenna Weick, NBC10 News. Lucky for Inductive and other tech companies, there's no shortage of engineers coming out of the Philadelphia area. Thanks for joining us for NBC10's Climate in Crisis. For more information on going green and sustainability, go to our website, NBC10.com slash climate change.